matches, and that this matchup is very doable, and he backed up his words by beating Psycho Midget in Peach Puff. Time stream, all right. Okay, so I think we're going into it right now. All right, there we go. I, I think this might be the person who Could. has the best chance of deep learning I think the, so too. The reason being is his character selection. Absolutely. He has Falcon and he has a Puff. It's Both are known to be good against Peach. Peach Slayer, he'll be able to do all sorts of crazy counterpicks in his best of five on any possible stage. And this is also a person who I think is willing to yeah. play this matchup to its, I guess, lane potential for the Puff side. You know, he will he will take everything he can get as far as the matchup goes, and that's what he needs to beat Aaron right now. Oh, that was very nice. Yeah. So in some ways, uh, Los Bacone's style is a hard... Oh, wow, that was a hard read with that Jesus up air. Christ. That was pretty amazing, actually. That was and filthy. He's, he's just winning, he's winning neutral by a lot. Like, this, this pressure is probably something he... Los Bacone yeah. did not see coming. Oh, these extensions on punishes on turnips. Did he really just connect all of that? And we got bears. And that, that's, the, that's the key to success. Power in this shield, everything. This is what this man does. His roommates complain about how much he power shields. Oh my gosh! He's not actually lucky poke. that he got shield poke there. Because if that shield gets broken, it's, it's pop. A, it's game over. You lose your stock. Dead character. Why does that happen? Balloon. I just don't. Because the balloon pops. You're right. Yeah, the, you're right. And, and it, the it's funny because he actually goes up. <laughs> you know, yeah. like he dies up. <laughs> but this is a. Uh, this is dominating. Okay. Is this gonna be a first? You two queen is oh unbelievable at this matchup. This is. Like, how is he this good at this matchup? Uh, do you, okay, do you think we're gonna see a character change? I think we might see a Falcon, because this, yeah. this is like... This is not looking close at all. It's not oh Peach, oh, oh, he's gonna just keep throwing oh hitboxes at him, because he knows if that shield breaks, yeah. it's over. Uh, and what, what do you think that Mitsuki's, like, aggression is really good? Yeah. He has a fundamental understanding of how to engage Puff off, like, every single kind of approach type thing. And this yeah. is what makes him such a strong contender for one of the best Arcadian Puff or Peaches in SoCal. Yeah. You know, right. San Diego, obviously. Do we have a four stock in Peach Puff? Are we seeing this? We're gonna see a four stock. I think we might see a character switch. And look at that instant out of shield. Oh, oh my, my god. Dude, we're gonna see a four stock? Oh, and the crowd is getting into it. And he's hitting every having the four stock. He is hitting every single shy drop, dash dance, shield drop thing possible here. We are incredibly impressed right oh, now. Yeah, this is crazy. This is a slaughter. And this is why we thought Mew Queen maybe shouldn't be allowed in the Arcadian just by his skill alone. But he hasn't ever been on a PR and he hasn't, you know... Yeah, so there's no way we can ban him unless... Like, he wasn't good enough where we had, you know... Yeah, not, not in the past. Not yeah. with a broken arm. Yeah. But, uh... Okay, we're back. We're and back. We, we still have the JV. Right. We still Could have the JV? JV. Yeah. JV and Peach Puff? That's extremely hard. <laughs> yep. Wait, JV, he won't. Not He's quite. He's not going to. Yeah. And just the strides that Mewtwo King and Queen has made as a player in the last six months are. Oh! oh okay. We had that fresh JV four star. JV that's and winners first, finals. That's what I love seeing in my, in my winners finals no. Canadians, right? Yo, look at the time. That was a three-minute Peach Puff game. One round. One round. One round. Yeah. God damn. And I think, is he, is he staying characters? He might stay. We might go to a stage that really exploits this as hard as he can. Okay, so we're going to final. This is interesting. Do you think we'll, we will see the um, switch to... Oh, wait. See, this is what he needs to do. Yeah, stay this close. Is, don't let him draw a turn. Why is he ever. not jumping out of that? Honestly, Puff kind of gets thwacked a couple times at low percent. Yeah. But you really have to, right now, he's doing survival DI, but he should not be getting humbled like that. You oh, know what I mean? Is he DIing in? I think he's DIing in. Oh man, but that's there's gonna no, get him hit with. But there's no point, right? Yeah. I also You're think that, I also think that most peaches he's played just don't try and combo him like this. Don't try and do the things yeah. that he does. These FC nares on his shield. I mean, I'm constantly worried that Los Pokemon's shield is gonna get broken. Power shield nair oh again. Oh my gosh, that was so good. Yeah. And if you give him uh, the smallest inclination that you're going to come in with an air at a specific timing, uh -huh. it's getting power shield every single time. Oh! Whoa, wait, he's still alive? He jumps out of shield, floats, does the aerial flow, cancels, and he does this all in about a quarter of a second. And, and Pe uh, Aaron's Peach is looking uber fast. Yeah, this, this is, is actually pretty insane. This is actually uh oh! Oh my gosh, he couldn't catch it. Was that? Did he hit one? That was a stitch. He hit with one, and look, he has 74% now. Wow, wow, Just wow. like that, the stock's going to stop. It's just crazy and, how well he's doing And he needs to put out more bears. That's why. Like, he needs to do this. This is where Puff excels in this matchup. 
Edge guard him, put bears, put bears, and how did he sneak low under the puff? I don't know. I'm trying to open China. There we go. Okay, we're, we're in this game. We have a competitive game. We haven't seen a single rest, but perhaps, perhaps as he catches some of these patterns, as Los Bacone oh, catches him. Oh, oh, that was his chance to come back. It really was. He needed that rest, in my opinion. He eat him with the hit him with the frying pan. Yeah. All right, go ahead, go ahead. And you know what? Like, Aaron is just looking so strong right now. This is, this is the reason why he was the favorite. Oh, oh my gosh, you're missing it, Jake. I can't believe you he's doing this. You should not be comboing uh, Jigglypuff like this. Like, I can't even combo puff like this. <laughs> I play I play Fox. How does he do this? Pretty insane, actually. Oh, wow. Okay. Back to it. He's got turnip after turnip after turnip that he's managing to draw. Stayed right outside his shield grab range. Got a down tilt. That could have actually led to something. Hit him with the reverse slap. He's got another, not really an edge guard opportunity because it's Puff, but he's got him off stage. Oh, good catch there. But he can't finish it off against oh this I, I think we're going to see a switch. I think we're going to see oh, a switch. I mean, after yeah. this, like, you've yeah. taken literally two stocks and two medals. Yeah. We've, we've been playing melee for about six minutes, and uh, you've taken one stock and peach, two yeah. stocks in. Puff Peach. Oh wow, he just straight up missed. Yeah. Straight up missed, and there was no. He just literally dropped down. He didn't even do any tricksies. Nah. And look at the. Oh my god. He's. He's actually amazing this play. Wow, this is actually really crazy. Yeah. Oh, why would you? Okay. Let's go out there. This is some of the highest level Peach Buff I've seen in SoCal in a while. Wow. Pretty insane. Like, you know, there's not really any puff players. Peligro, Peligro versus Psycho Midget at uh, the JJ's Arcadian Losers Finals. Now, that was something. But this, this is a click. And he's waiting for the roll. Close Pagone does not cover tech, uh, tech get up regularly. Okay, now he's jumping as he's doing the pressure. And he's getting out of things like down smash. He's getting yeah. away from some of this, which is good. But if, if, um, if Aaron guesses right, he's just going to eat an air. He's um he's going under the bears every time he pull on with a uh, instant float near. Nice. Okay, good edge guard. We got something on and, the board. He's he's gonna need a miracle to win this game. Yeah, he absolutely is. Yeah. There's no reason to win this game unless. Oh no! But you went to the legs and you let him draw a positive EV turn up the winky face. Eight is something percent. Yes. Oh, you need to. You can't even rest. Oh. You can't even rest there. Not at all. Cause you're gonna die. All right. So I think we're gonna see the switch right now. That is a solid, solid two stock. I need, to, I need to put out a tweet real fast. Oh, but we have pizza. What are we doing? Oh, we got oh, pizza. So we, all right. Shout outs to our sponsors. Pizza. Oh, Fresh Hot Pizza. And shout outs to all the sponsors for uh, oh the actual San Diego Melee Arcadian. We got Tespa. We got Winter Game Fest. Six Hog, yeah. Ten Hog, this pizza. Thank um, you. SC Melee Arcadian 2, powered by Tespa. Did you yeah. say that already? Thank you, Tespa. MSI, Zotag, Gigabyte, Jinx. Jinx, and Twitch. Hey, Young Twitch. Thank you so much. Which we're on right now. Yeah. Ah, what do you if know? You, if you would look in the, uh, the, le the top side of your, <laughs> of your browser, you're going to see that we're on Twitch. Huh, crazy. Yep. That's the site you're on. Okay, and we have the... And we have, we have what um, we thought was going to happen. The oh, predicted counter pick, the Los, Bef the Los Bethalco. <laughs> and this is a oh, great stage to do here it. Here we go. You know, it's actually not a character we see very much in San Diego these days. The Falcon, we've got Punk, we've got Black Diar, we've oh. got this guy. And this guy might be the best one. That's actually really funny how he might be, you know... He's a contender Whoa. for the best Puff and Falcon. Yeah. Active in San Diego. Wow. He tried drop down yeah. up there. That would have been crazy. Because yeah. you would have gotten a lot of down. So what's up with this? That should be it. Should have oh, been the second time he ran into that. You can't really be running into the Mac D. No, you can't. You got to respect that when they're on that platform, they can oh, just wow, throw he just that grab that? You know, I thought Lowe's Bacconi was winning this. Yeah, me too. But then, like, he just lost the stock. Aaron started bringing I thought us. he was winning neutral, but you know, like every hit that um, Aaron gets, he makes a count. Los Pagone had a really nice oh. jump call with an air, just the weak oh one. Oh my. Hit. Oh wow, what the? And he's that was actually pretty nice. Oh, oh, how do you keep following That's up? It. That's a dead character. That's it. Okay, three stocks to three. We have a pretty competitive game right here. We've got Falcon Peach. Let's see if Los Pagone is counter picking. And he's already taken as many stocks with this Falcon as he has with the, with the puff. Oh, you know, he took two, uh, two last game, but no, he's got him with Thought Bears. There is no jump. Oh my god. Oh no, he did have a jump. Yeah, well, he got it back after he landed again. Oh, I didn't even know he landed. Oh, good wow, catch by Derek. A, yeah, he called that out, though. Damn. 
Aaron is playing nice. Yeah. Aaron's playing real nice. Yeah. Okay, good wait by Los Bacone. He's got him on the windmill. But Aaron just shields out of the way. Oh, why is, why is he going for these up smashes? He's going for like Hail Mary up smashes. Not really sure, but every single time Los Bacone is going for these grabs in the scramble situation, Beach Queen's putting out a down tilt. Oh, wow, that would have been crazy. That would have been pretty. He needs, uh, he needs to finish oh, off these combos. He called oh, stop. Oh my god. Arbada. Oh, he got eaten in the face. So the second time he's done that. Yep. Okay, Beach Queen back on stage. Oh, oh, here we go. That's auto. The big knee. I'm gonna eat this pizza. Yeah. Alright, so while Leland starts eating this pizza, I'm gonna talk a little bit about what we've got here. Um, Los Pacone in danger of going down 3 0 and losing the set. <laughs> Not really going, going down. Going down, he's actually just going down. Yeah, he's just going yeah. down to the loser's bracket. Damn. Might be his last stock of winners. Okay, Aaron keeps away from him really nicely. Staying on the ground. Oh, Power shield. Lock. Grab. Okay, it doesn't really get the conversion. We got King Andrew here stealing some pizza. This guy. And another power shield. Dude, he needs to get some combos going. Yeah. And it's hard. He just needs a growl. Aaron's he got a good down the way DI off a lot. And he's power shielding he's literally he's half the stuff that he's throwing out. Oh! Big combo. Can he get an edge guard? Oh, oh nice. nice! And he's back in it. He juked him out. It looked like he was yeah. trying to back air or reverse up air, but he landed really fast, caught Aaron falling down. Hauled him out with the dash attack. Okay, Good damage. Weird transformation. Oh, Anything whoa. could happen. Aaron ends up on the bad side of that, but he's gonna try and pull turnips. Oh no, he's just oh. gonna go right back into it. Every time I see the uh, fire stage and they're on opposite sides, yeah. it reminds me of Episode One from Star Wars. He's got him in the corner. You have, I have the you high ground, Anakin. <laughs> oh, oh, do you think That's he's trying to be there? Oh, he thought he'd roll in, maybe. Oh, oh, I thought he was gonna knee. I thought he was gonna put that big knee. I thought that I was he was gonna put the oh. knee into his face. Okay, he can go. Oh, the what double the? turn of re grab. That's it. Oh, that's that it. was beautiful. And that's a 3 yeah. 0. Tight game three, though. Wow. Wow. Tight. If he does make it back to. Uh